How to change image banner size in Shopify. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I am going to show you how you can change your banner size on the Shopify store. It is very easy and very simple. All you have to do is to follow up the tutorial from the beginning till the end and you will be good to go. The first thing that you need to do is to go ahead to Shopify.com then sign into your account. Then you are simply going to set up everything in your shop from the products, uh, content, and also the collections. Then simply you are going to the online store under the sales channels. Here we have to customize the theme. I will let you see here the first method that it is very limited, but it is okay if you don't know how to code. And then we are going to proceed to the next method. Now, select the theme that you are going to make the adjustments on, click on customize, and then simply it will show up the uh, website editor. Right here, we have the banner. I'm going to let you see here the banner and how to add it. Here we have the image banner. If you want to add a image banner, all you have to do is to go right there to sections click on add sections then we are going to see here image banner click on it and it will be added right there we have the image that we can go ahead and add for example right there i'm going to add an image and i will let you see how uh, is it now i'm going to select a banner that i have created this is the banner i'm going to select it click on done and we will get the result now for these texts it is very simple to delete them i'm going to delete those i don't need these buttons also and here i don't need that particular text i only need that banner when you click on the banner here we have the choice of image overlay opacity and the banner height you can go ahead and set it small and it is a little bit smaller but here we are going to play on the height and not the size itself here we have the medium and we have the large as you can see this is the largest image that we can put now when you see here the uh, the choices or the parameters to this banner it is very limited you cannot see and set the sizes from there so for this case i am going to put the size or the banner height to medium click on save simply we are going to do some codings now we are going back to the themes we are going to select that theme that we are going to work on Click on the three dots right there, click on edit code. And here on the edit code, don't make everything uh, that is complicated. It is very easy. Don't see those numbers and those codes and those uh, curly brackets. Simply we are going to filter files and search for a certain file. Here I am going to type only theme dot liquid theme theme like that dot liquid and here we have it this is it click on the theme dot liquid and now we are simply going to scroll down to the end of the code until we see here body and html right there i'm going to this part make some space two or three lines like that i only need two or three lines then i'm going to put the cursor right there uh, to the middle section now i have a code that i am going to copy copy that code right there copy it go back right there to the middle section that we have created paste it right there and here we have it now we have this code i'm going to put it on the description or the comment section then we have to apply it only you don't need to make any coding so it will be much easier for you when you finish all the integration or 
the uh, put of the code, simply click on save. When you click on save, everything will be in order. Here in this code, you can see here the max width of the image. Here we have section ID. It is the image or the banner image. Here we have the uh, max width. It is put to 80% and here we have the width to 100%. This is the size of the uh, banner. You can go ahead and play with this max width. And also you can put and play with the width itself. You can go ahead and put it, for example, 200 or 150 like that. Put it right here. And here the max width, put it 150 also. And the width itself, I'm going to put to 120. Click on save and here we are going to see the modification to the banner. Go exit, back to the themes, customize and here normally we are going to see the changement. As you can see, the banner size has increased a lot and we have a lot of space right there. We have even a horizontal scroll bar right there. This is for the first banner and also for the second banner. If you want to make them a little bit smaller, you are going back to the code, themes, edit code, go to the themes.liquid, scroll down until you see the code that we have added. Here I'm going to modify this to 100% only and the width, let it here. 100 and also that one I'm going to put it 100 click on save and then we are going to see the changement that we have made here we have to click on customize and we will see here the difference as you can see here we have the scrolling horizontal bar disappeared and the banner is much wider and for this is for the first banner and also for the second banner. These settings that you have saw or you have made will apply for all the banner or image banner that you are going to put in the future or also the setup banners. So make sure to choose the right width for your banner and then you can go ahead and customize the banner height. For example, put it large. And also for the banner height, you are going to make it a little bit uh, wide for the white screens and etc. Make sure that you see here the both versions of the desktop uh, and also the mobile. Since we are going to see here the, uh, the series or the mobile. As you can see here, it is not mobile friendly. So you have to make sure that you are going to decrease the image size that was all for today's video i hope you guys that you have enjoyed the content and hope to see you soon on the next one